of Annie's kitchen and well-being in today's edition we are going to be making Nigerian cake okay so again we're gonna be making Nigerian cake and these are the ingredients we need to make this Nigerian cake so delicious okay so over here I have vanilla extract baking powder liquid milk honey so instead of using sugar I decided to use honey which is healthier than regular sugar okay I have my all-purpose flour I have egg so this is free range egg okay and that makes cake much more better I have my nutmeg I have my butter sticks you can use any butter of your choice okay and I'm gonna be using this oil spray to grease my pan okay so I'm gonna be using this electric mixer you can always use hand mixer or you can always use your whip to whip it real good okay so use whatever that is available to you okay all right let's go okay so I have my all papers flour please make sure you sift your flour and I have the baking powder and the nutmeg so I'm gonna just mix it thoroughly all right, so this is totally mixed, okay? And I have cracked the eggs as well. And I have the butter sticks in the mixer. So I'm gonna start mixing it. Okay, so I'm adding the eggs. You can see the butter and the egg. So this is the vanilla extract. Just add it, okay? And I'm gonna add this honey just little by little okay so I'm gonna add the milk I'm gonna be adding the flour little by little okay. okay so after whipping this for a while you can change to this this is more like to thoroughly mix it okay hey okay, guys you can just use a little bit of flour just to make the pan a little more um, comfortable for the baking <laughs> if you can say that and after that you turn your oven on to 350 degree to just uh, the bake it goes to 350 so I'm gonna set my cook time to 45 minutes okay then I'm gonna start preheating it for five minutes before I put the cake in the butter in okay all right okay so i'm pouring the butter into the pan okay all right so this other one goes to the little pan mm -hmm. and i put the remaining one here do this you know just to flatten this butter mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. then you put it into your oven so the oven has been preheated we're just gonna put it in is in there yeah so the butter are in so we're gonna leave it in there for 25 minutes then we'll check on it okay 
all right fam so our cake is done mm -hmm. so look at it yep the cake is done looking so yummy so if you don't want it to dry uh to brown this much you can make it lightly brown but this is exactly how i want mine to be okay I like my cake a little crunchy on the outside all right look at the cake pretty pretty cake you cannot miss this look at that okay so I'm gonna use a big knife to cut this cake okay mm -hmm. so that you can see how pretty it looks from the middle okay so I'm gonna use this to pick it up. Mm, look at this. Yep, look at this corner too. Looking all good. Mm-hmm. Yep. So if you look at this cake very closely, it's not so yellow because of the honey that I used to mix it. Okay, you know honey is brown. So that's why this cake is more like brown so it's not like it's burnt because i use honey to do it okay which is very very healthy so look at this cake mm -hmm. yep very pretty very very one yep so next time when you bake your cake try using honey okay so it doesn't have to be all about sugar all the time just um, do some different okay mm -hmm. look at this Woo -hoo! very lovely mm. yep that's another slice of my cake Yeah, that's cake made with honey and not sugar. Yeah, so I'm gonna taste it. Mmm. September we met. I could tell by a smile. You hadn't been with a good girl like me in a while. Yeah, you were impressed. Couldn't leave me alone. Text me every time. I guess you say, My girl, my girl. Says you say, What can make me say, My girl, my girl.